Well, tension in the air here. It's got all the ingredients, hasn't it? And it's our main feature today on EA TV. Join us soon. Hi there, everybody. Welcome to Stamp. For Bridge. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Premier League football we have for you. It's coming right up. It's Chelsea against Manchester United. I think if we get a nice, sharp, quick tempo to begin with, we're in for a real treat here because we've got a couple of entertaining sides that love to go forward. Well, they could get the ball back here and they have done. Here's the Chelsea lineup. Signing a goal, Jan Oblak. Nelson Semedo starts alongside Bernat in the fullback positions. Hakim Ziyech plays with Angolo Conte in the middle of midfield. And they're going to go with one striker up front. The pass not completed, really. Delivery to the far post. Well, that's good defending. They've shuffled their pack today, Manchester United. Chris Smalling starts alongside Alessio Romagnoli in the heart of defence. Only one up front in terms of an out-and-out forward. Chelsea give it away. Pogba. Arsenal not good at the moment. The Gunners don't seem to have too much ammunition so far this season. Yeah, I just can't see them closing the gap now and uh, getting into one of those Champions League positions. For a start off, the team spirit looks awful. Jaden Sancho. Manchester United have won the ball back here. Well, a strong character in the Manchester United lineup and a strong probing pass. Rashford. And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Good interception. See edge. Good pressure in midfield and it's paid off. Now Lingard. Matic. Can put them in front here. Brilliant defending. It's safe. Well, the reward is a goal for winning the ball high up the pitch. Well, we could see it coming, I think. And I think even the team that's just conceded could see it coming because they kept on losing the ball in dangerous areas there. Manchester United with the lead. The defender really putting his body on the line to stop the cross. Excellent interception. It's Jesse Lingard. Alan McAnally is at the London Stadium today with some news of a goal. It's a goal for Fulham. 31 minutes played. 1-0. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. Manchester United with the ball again. Going forward well. Semedo. Sancho. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline whip it in now excellent reading of those danger signs by the defender at a crucial moment looking for teammates in the middle well that's a wonderful strike so close it's great improvisation and great athleticism as well he just mistimed it slightly contact Chelsea chasing an equaliser here. And they might have that in them. Well, I think they've got to get better. Maybe a few stern words from the gaffer at half time will do the trick. Dealt with the danger. They're looking good when they attack. Trying to find Cristiano Ronaldo. Good punch from the goalkeeper from the cross. And two more minutes to play, that of added time. Two minutes. Done well under pressure here to hold the ball as the challenge came in. Well, I guess he was aiming for a teammate, but he certainly didn't find one. So it's 1-0 here as the half-time whistle goes.
Manchester United get the second half underway. Here's Wendell. Well, our reporter Alan McAnally is at the Etihad and he's got news of a goal. It's a goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Ilke Gundogan. He finished it with a looping header over the keeper's outstretched glove. 48 minutes played, 1-0. That's Alan McAnally keeping us bang up to date. And that's what the coach would want, to stop the supply into the middle. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Yeah, it was a good first 45 minutes from the lad. Got the ball rolling with that goal, and he's been central to most of the good things his team has done. Manchester United's change about to take place. Not a good pass at all. What about Manchester United's next game, Alan? Yeah, they're playing Everton in the next match. And uh, I don't know really what the score's going to be here. I don't think there's going to be much between them. Been a lot of stories about Toby Alderweireld over the last few seasons. The latest one, it's only rumour, really. He might have put his teammate in here. He fancies his chances of getting past these players. That's safely away. Alan McAnally's got news of a goal in the Manchester City game. It's a goal for Newcastle United. Really in the clear now, in on goal. Golden opportunity now. Chelsea are back in business, they're level again. No surprise, they were creating chances. Well, he's shown plenty of pace, composure in the finishing. It's a fine individual goal. There's a change coming up, and it's for Manchester United. So, away we go at one all. Bit of an interruption there for Alan McAnally. You understand why with the game going on here, we can confirm that Newcastle did score in their match, and the match is level at 1-1. Sending off at Sheffield United. It's a red card for Arsenal. They're down to 10 men. 69 minutes, please. It remains 1-1. Thanks, Alan. Well, we'll follow that with interest. Going forward well. Well, they've got him behind here. Rashford. No, it's offside. And it looks as though they might be in to score. Some activity on the Chelsea bench. Going in as a group in midfield, not as individuals, to win the ball back. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Chelsea, they're taking chances, getting the fullbacks forward. The fans sense that. What a noise. That's a wasted throw, he's given it straight to the opposition. Oh, time to get the cross now. The shot's on! Super block. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Spaced across the ball now. 1-1 here, time ticking away. Can we look ahead to their next game, Alan? Well, Chelsea go up against Crystal Palace after this. It's been a hard match out here, but certainly they haven't reached the levels they have in previous games. In the Bournemouth game, we're hearing there's a goal. Alan McAnally can bring us right up to speed. It's a third goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Looking for goal now. Or is this the winning moment for Chelsea? Look at them celebrate. They do think it's the winner. Chelsea... Might have thought they couldn't do it, but they've done it, it seems. Well, they have got that resilience in the ranks. You can never discount them. Manchester United have to try to come from behind. <laughs> Words of wisdom, as usual, from Alan McAnally. A bit shorter than he wanted. Confirmation for you that Wolves scored in that match. And they are winning 3-0. Well, it's a 90-minute match, and there's only two minutes to go. Sancho, two minutes left, that's added time. 
Wan Bissaka. Togba. Chris Smalling. Well, that's it. The final whistle. This is the team. We've got some questions for you. No further questions. I swear daylight comes too soon. After party, everyone roll through. Don't matter where I go, as long as I go with you. I swear daylight comes too soon, daylight comes too soon. I swear daylight comes too soon. After party, everyone roll through. Don't matter where I go, as long as I go with you. I swear daylight comes too soon, daylight comes too soon. Nice swear daylight comes too soon. Everywhere I go, I bring the man them fruit. Got a shout the girl them too. Nice swear daylight comes too soon. Nice swear daylight comes too soon. Everywhere I go, I bring a man them fruit. Got a shout the girl them too. Nice swear daylight comes too soon. Roll if there ain't a venue. Lime and coke on the menu. Wanna dress cash for bouncers won't let you. Good thing promoters they can still get you in. Stepped in a bash, already. Go where I want, got a triple A pass. Got one for Oak and got one for Cas. Got one for Mass and got one for Wax. Sit down, I need a sec to relax. If you want a photo, just need to ask. Take one with them without the flash. Head to the whip out the cash. Who's is it? It's all there, man. Don't need to count it. It ain't counterfeit, man. I'm out of it. But I still ain't down to dip. Next where daylight comes too soon. Everywhere I go, I bring them and them fruit. Got a shout out the girl them too. Nice where daylight comes too soon. Nice where daylight comes too soon. Everywhere I go, I bring them and them fruit. Got a shout out the girl them too. Nice where daylight comes too soon. I see strangers walk past me. Look around, see friends that are family. What do you fancy? End of the night, what I feet to And welcome everyone on what is a perfect day for football here in South London. The venue is Selhurst Park. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Crystal Palace taking on Chelsea. I'm excited, Derek. Really looking forward to this game. Come on, bring it on. Might be able to get in behind the defence. The delivery cleared away comprehensively well this is the team Crystal Palace have picked Raita gets the nod in goal Alexander Dragovic plays alongside James Tompkins in central defence there it is and just the ideal start well I love looking at replays you get to see the goal in all its glory just look at this perfect header what a goal So underway once again, Chelsea with the lead in this match. And a goal to tell you about at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Tottenham Hotspur, nine minutes played, 1-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. Tammy Abraham, and he's made headway. Well, look at it again. I do question the defenders, but let's give credit to him. What a wonderful solo effort. And he still has the presence of mind to finish it off. What a brilliant solo goal. Well, a second goal for them here. Milton Casco. Options around him. Gliding through the gears. It comes to absolutely nothing. Pulisic now. Sancho now. Oh, that's an interesting pass. 
It might be on for them. Not that he's... Oh, he's only gone and scores! Christian Pulisic! Well, let's see that again. It's a decent save from the keeper, but it bounces back into play. Where were his defenders? The strikers there pushes it into the net. And we're underway again. This game very much over as a contest. Might be a chance here. Will he? The goals keep going in for them. I don't think they're going to throw this away now. Absolutely omnipotent. As we can see, right place at the right time. Striker's instinct is to be there or thereabouts. Keeper has no chance. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Someone's found the net at the London Stadium. Who exactly? Alan McAnally? It's a goal for West Ham United. 22 minutes played, 1-0. Thank you, Alan McAnally. An abundance of space. And so it will be a corner. Corner kick played over. Paddy Alisco. That's plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department. And Kelly with it. Alvaro. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Kelly. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And the danger clear. Mount. Abraham. Tammy Abraham. Mateo Kovacic. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. And whipped into the box. And clears his lines. McCarthy. Nowhere to go, really. He's being closed down. Oh, nice ball. Alvaro. And you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. Happy to take on the shot. Good stop from the keeper. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Corner kick played in. The idea was to get the corner beyond the first defender, but he didn't succeed. Milton Casco. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Casco. Fed over towards the back post. Still alive. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Mateo Kovacic Renan Lodi Mount and a strong tackle and he did what he had to do defensively and that's an important intervention and there it is, the half-time and so the second half is underway they took quite the thrashing in that first 45. Can they turn things around now? Abraham has given it straight to the opposition. Trying his luck from long range. Possession one. Well, they were clearly on the receiving end, so a free kick is next. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Just a quick reminder, action from the third round of the FA Cup coming up live on EA TV. It's Crystal Palace taking on Stoke City. Yeah, break from league action for players. Always a good atmosphere when it's knockout football. Should be a great match, that. It's all about translating threats into goals. Great opportunity! And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot, straight at him, no problem for the goalie. Is it going to be Pulisic? It really is such 
a free-scoring performance. Just nothing the defenders can do about it, seemingly. Well, as we look at this again, what they always say, focus on the ball, ensure you strike it cleanly. He's done just that. What a finish. Well, as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Just a quick reminder, action from the third round of the FA Cup coming up live on EA TV. It's Chelsea taking on Brighton. Yeah, cup football has its own special atmosphere for me. The stakes can be really costly. Can't wait for that one. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Straight down the throat of the opposition. I believe there's been a goal in the Spurs game. Alan McAnally can fill us in. It's the second goal for Tottenham Hotspur. 64 minutes played, 2-0. Thank you, Alan McAnally. An incisive pass. Happy to take on the shot, given the position he was in. He's not going to be especially pleased with himself. Well, he took the chance with power. Not always the best option. Well, Derek, the stats don't lie. Chance after chance. They've played really, really well. They've really got this defence on toast. They don't know what to do. They're at sixes and sevens. This scoreline could be anything. Alvaro. So a throw in to Chelsea. So 20 minutes to go. James and whipped into the box still possibilities and he's clear as lines and on the second half here and it's almost Lee a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals while well, creating goals is and that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that I believe there's been a goal on the Aston Villa match. Let's hear about that goal from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Aston Villa. 76 minutes played. 2-1. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Can they get in behind them? A fine block. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Gliding through the gears. Paddy Elisco. Running towards goal. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Cutting the ball back. It's still alive. An attack full of promise, cross-fired over, classy goalkeeping. Well, it was a good save from the goalkeeper, but you'd expect him to make that save, wouldn't you? Corner kick played over. He has time to play it over. A, minimum of two minutes of a time. sloppy pass. Has a go. And the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened. Tammy Abraham. You know, Chelsea have an awful lot of space. Crossing opportunity. Corner it is for Chelsea. So the corner played into the box. And a corner there that really lacked guile. It comes to nothing. That's it. The referee brings the action to an end. Tammy Abraham.
Can I ask you a couple of questions? That'll be all. Daring ten. Big R1, I'll be daring ten. Where and when? Big R1, I'll be daring ten. I am the boogeyman scaring men. Call out my name and I appear with. Come to a video shoes in your ends. I will turn up early yard, then your cameraman bear equipment. You be thinking it's them. Hold on, wait there, where's this lens? There's his lens, unsatisfied thing, where's his friends? Mad. You men are camping, my animals are outraging for you, it's bare intense. Yeah. Why would I scrap when I'm here with Man, don't care if your ears are bent. Nah. No, my I will ring a big 15 like Big Ben. Test me how, phone man's phone up, let's meet now. now. Kick this thing off like Jet Li, bow. David Louise absolutely foul. Man. Don't f*** your f***, sit down, cause I went Deptford Green. I got Chinese man that would drive by your favourite restaurant and you'll get your main chick. What did you think? I will scream and shout. Huh? You ain't nothing if you ain't seen cloud. Nah. Bet ten bags I will find these house. Ten. Walk one mum's against my man about. Man, go to mumsy's mum's house. What I'm nan? Huh? Dead serious, you don't want it with man. I've told this boy not to f with man. Told him. Where and when? Big R1, I'll be daring ten. Told him. Where and when? Big R1, I'll be daring ten. Told him. Where and when? Big R1, I'll be daring ten. Blood. Man, I hear with here with here with here with <sighs> Scaring men. Big I'll be there in 10. Old school, I'll be there with spend. Big black geezer is there in them. Yeah, staring them. They dare me, but I'm daring them. Oh no, I ain't hearing them. Double M, yeah, I'm here with M. <laughs> Clapped in this bingo. That's right. Man, let the tingo. Who, him? Man, that's an insult. insult. Chips on the man, and she's hearing the lingo. lingo. Back on a spider. I'm a spider. On the rider, I'll slap my fiber. <laughs> 20 bands, all black with a driver. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 50 man in the back getting liver. Get that's 50 gang in the back, that's a minor. <laughs> man just talk and rap, that's a minor. Yeah, yeah. You gas man up and that's an advisor. Switch it. Where and when I creep in the air FM, I'm sleeping in here, West End. Road deep, I'll be there, West End. No street fight, I know Ryu. No street fight here with Ken. No cheapness in here, we spend. Road deep, I'll be there, we can. I'm with Sky. No sleep, I'm in there with Spen. SM1, full heap, I'm in there with Clem. Man just spit, I'm in here with Flem. Man just dipped, that's P-Money there again. Where and when, Big R1, I'll 